Welcome to this week's edition of the WVU Sports Buzz. I'm Amanda Maisie. Joining you today from High Street because Friday night fans will line the streets and watch all the exciting entries in the annual WVU Homecoming Parade. You know, homecoming festivities date all the way back to 1910. Of course, the icing on the cake will be the football game Saturday night against number 21, Oklahoma State. By the time that game begins, the number one ranked rifle team will have already started and ended their first match of the season. They open up Saturday morning at Air Force. I think we've all been working really hard um, for preseason and practicing every day and stuff like that. And so I think it's going to be uh, really good to just get the first match under our belt. I think we're all um, very excited to travel and get that done. You're a senior, but since your freshman year, you've been a part of a national championship team every single year. I'm assuming that you want to end this school year, you know, your final season with a national championship again. Right. Um, you know, I think that's a goal that everybody wants. Um, and, you know, it's not that I haven't thought about it, but, you know, we just try to take one match at a time. And, um, you know, right now we're focused on Air Force and, you know, we'll just see what happens. There are so many good shooters on this team. I mean, from top to bottom, everybody is solid. In your opinion, what makes this team so good? Um, I think we all work very well together. Um, you know, I think that um, our team chemistry is very good and you know I think that coach does a really good job recruiting and and bringing in people that are just going to add to our team chemistry and I think that that's what helps us succeed. The team will turn around and face Nebraska Sunday morning as they begin their quest for a fourth straight national title. Well some pool records were set last weekend during the annual gold blue swim meet. The swimming and diving teams hope to set even more records when they host the West Virginia State Games this Thursday and Friday. I'm so excited to have the games here. We all are. It's a great first meet to start out with. There's a lot of teams. It's a really fun atmosphere, too, so we're all excited. You're a diver, mm -hmm. such a specialized sport, and I would imagine it's just as mental as it is physical. What is the hardest aspect of what you do up there? The hardest thing is just getting comfortable with all your dives because you're the only one up there when you're about to go, and all eyes are on you. So you just need to be comfortable with what you're doing and know that you've done it in practice a thousand times. You can do it this time as well. So. We were just talking. These are springboards right here, mm -hmm. but you do platform um, events at other schools, but you can't train for a platform here. Tell me about how you do that. It's a little bit scary, but we actually practice in the gymnastics gym, doing flips and things off of the vault, trying to get comfortable with the different type of surface that you're jumping off of. And then at meets, we have about one day of practice, and then we go for it just to try and get our team some points and stuff like that. So. I love it. Your mom was a diver here. She had many records. Mm -hmm. You know, how special is it to know that your mom is swimming in the same pool or you're swimming in the same pool that you did with your mom? It's really crazy. I saw pictures of her in this pool from years and years ago and I love knowing that she was doing, here doing the same exact thing. She comes to as many meets as she can and she still just loves the sport of diving. A huge weekend in the pool for WVU. It's the Big 12 versus ACC Challenge. Georgia Tech Friday night, followed by Virginia Tech on Saturday. Should be a great weekend. Well, don't forget, if you're coming to the parade here on High Street Friday night, get here early. It all begins at 630 and the parade never disappoints. Thanks for watching this edition of the WVU Sports Buzz. I'm Amanda Maisie.